never know who he's going to go. It depends on uh, who he's playing against, I guess, or what character. So this time he's going Greninja. He's, uh, he's been feeling very comfortable with Greninja tonight. He's been actually practicing Greninja a lot lately. Uh, his mix-ups and his movement and everything. So he, I feel like he's gotten better with that. So uh, he's feeling very comfortable with that tonight. Uh, Depth's uh, Samus has been strong as usual. All right. And they're going to Dreamland. Interesting. I feel like this is like the leftover two, stage. One, if they go. don't get a two battlefield, they go here because it still has three platforms. However, the combos aren't as strong because the stage is actually bigger. Okami's trying to land his hit confirms for his combos, but if he doesn't, he just. He's been poking, poking at depth. Crushing him with the shuriken. Oh, two fairs in a row, wow. I'm surprised he the up air. Oh, wow. That charge shot was not full at all, but got a decent amount of damage on him. Death is slowly but surely coming back on the percentages. And Tommy SDs, that is unfortunate. Gives Death a chance to finally uh, charge his charge shot all the way up. Tommy's trying to secure that kill without getting any percentage. Doesn't seem to be laying off of him at all, though. 23%, one shot. Exactly what Death wanted to do. Get as much percentage before losing his stock, if he even loses it. Okami is trying to get in Death. Oh, nice. Shadow Sneak. Doesn't look like he saw the shadow on the ground. Wow. Hit can come off of a shuriken into a grab. That was impressive. Oh, and there's a combi. Let's do the shenanigans. Greninja's jump is so high, it's ridiculous. He really thrives on these platforms. Oh, jumps over his air into a fair, but this is a follow-up. Again. That was very uh, good by Okami. It was a very intelligent thing to do. While he was off stage, he did the uh, Shadow Snake. You can't see the shadow in the air. And so, I had no idea that's what he was doing. Covering the get-up options. Oh, nice spot, guys. To a down tilt. Death is trying to get that charge shot. Be out of shield. And that'll do it with the rage. Death takes this first match. It is now zero. Thomas. I'm wondering if Okami's gonna go Greninja or not. <laughs> yep, looks like he's going Greninja. Nope, looks like he's not going Greninja. Switching the match. Yep, I knew it. <laughs> Uh. All right, so Death's Band's Dreamland doesn't want him to go back there. It's not a fun stage. You got uh, Wispy blowing blowing everybody around, messing up combos. Sometimes he makes you SD. I don't like it. I always ban that stage. All right, and he's counterpicking with Smashville. It's not really that many Three, good counter picks two, in this uh, one, in this game with the uh, Paragon rules, simply because there's like two. <laughs> so you might as well go back to another neutral. So Smashville is like a everybody's favorite stage, basically. It's the new it's the new FD final destination. All right, so 
two very uh, campy characters. However, at the same time, you don't have to be campy with them. They have, they have decent uh, neutrals. And as you can see, they're kind of just going back and forth. Not really comboing. That was a really good read by Death. Oh my gosh, that's a great read. Baiting the air dodge and punishing it with it on B. Oh, nice confirm out of that Metal Blade into a RAR. And there goes Okami. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, and then gets the read. He missed that first kill of the back air. I, I don't even understand how he missed that. That's usually true. I don't know what happened. But then he gets the read with the up smash. Takes the first stock. Death tries to get that up there. Oh, the up he got a shield. He misses that. Okami is just throwing projectiles like crazy. But that doesn't seem to be stopping Death's momentum. His movement is still good. He's covering ground options. However, Okami is in the infinite uh, up B mode. Death is just poking at his shield, looking for an opening for that charge shot. He shoots and misses. It's really difficult not to run in on Mega Man simply because Mega Man pressures you so much with his items. You can't stay away because you'll just get hit. So you have to move around a lot and try to get in. That was great Trump. And finally, he gets the kill. However, he's down 73%. Oh, wow. <laughs> 95 percent in two seconds. Wow. So the game is one one right now. One one. Yep. Tommy oh, takes that. JV two stock. Mega Man. Very close matches here. Yes, they are very close. They're going back and forth. I wonder who Depp's gonna pick. He might, he might end up picking somebody, somebody else. <laughs> I'm just kidding. He's strictly Samus main. He's Samus and nobody else. And it looks like Okami's also going Mega Man again. And they take it back to Smashville because that's a fan favorite. Oh, Okami is not going Mega Man. He's going Pikachu. Okami played Pikachu, I think, once tonight. If I'm not mistaken. I wonder why he changed. He might not have felt very comfortable with that last matchup. I don't know. Or maybe he just wants to give his Pikachu a shot. Pikachu has phenomenal frame data, though. Pikachu. Oh, wow. As you can see, Pikachu just continuously throws out attacks. Mo majority of those attacks being lagless. Just able to just throw out a barrage of attacks, and then that way, death is forced to, to either shield or move or try to punish it, but it's very difficult for Death to punish because Samus is, uh, Samus's moves come out a lot slower than Pikachu, so what he's going to have to do is either read what he's going to do or throw out an extended hitbox and hope that he runs into it like that jab he just did. That was great. That was a phenomenal read. Got the grab. Got the trump. Gets back on the stage and gets that up tilt kill. Takes the first stock. So Kami is currently down by 90%. And we got the air dodge right for the up tilt. Very nice. So Kami seals the deal there. Takes his stock. 59% on Okami. However, Pikachu is a lot like Sheik. 
He thrives on uh, low percentage combos. If he gets an up tilt, he'll probably end up with like 40%. Choose a phenomenal combo. Or you just don't look at him. He's just constantly throwing out stuff because he can. That's what kind of character he is. But that is not swaying depth at all. Depth protecting himself. Using great spacing techniques. Nice punish. Wow, and the down tilt hits from behind. Pikachu is at kill percent now. And gets punished with the F smash. And then depth wins. Two to one.